Uh, let's see, Golgari Crackle, I think is it's a very healthy name for this kind of list. Uh, so then I think it's time to just look at the lessons, the non-land lessons, that is. Environmental sciences, I'm willing to run. Run up to two of those, huh? Pest summonings are fine. Necrotic seems fine. Payment breach is fine. And I think that several mascot exhibitions are fine. All right. All right. You want to call this Jund Crackle? Mm -mm, not a chance. Not happening. Some juicy cards. I mean, it just simply looks good to me. It simply looks good to me. gonna run pest summoning you know i actually kind of think i want to get a second pest summoning in here because i think delaying the game is healthy and good way to play my opponent is doing some kind of ramp probably better than our version of ramping slightly worried about not having enough things that fill our graveyard that's what i'm worried about I'm worried about having not enough things to fill the graveyard. Hmm. Hmm. That's okay. That is okay. That's what we were born to do. We're just going to hunt for so many Spossomans. Yeah, look at this. Boom. I mean, well. Might as well get this. Let's just continue to smash on in there. Oh. Alright, there we go. Independence says, hey Dan, I'm attending my first game jam this week, and I wonder if you could share some thoughts on how to evaluate the funness of a mechanic slash game. You know, honestly, here's the big thing that I would encourage you uh, to think about independence. It's going to be three things I'm going to suggest. Because I have two things, but I always pad it into a list of three to make myself feel more authoritative. Before I do, let me do some gameplay, but there's three things about game jam. Hey, Militant Humor says, 1 a.m. here in Scotland, so I'm going to head to bed. Have a good night and good draw. Thousand bits. Thanks again, Militant Humor. It's thoughtful, sweet, and truly elite of you. Gretchen Titchwilly. Oh, my God. Are we in... Are we in draft? What doth did happen? Deadly Dispoot. Shit. I don't have enough things filling my bin for this to be any value right now. Rats. God, mana is so good right now. The forest will be overrun. The forest will be overrun. Alright, three things to think about if you're doing a game jam. About the funness of stuff. Okay. Thing number one. I don't have a sweeper in here. I don't have a sweeper in here fucking at all. My god, Gretchen Titchwilly's doing it. Okay, first thing. Careful not to conflate the fun of creation with the fun of your game. 
Those meat hooks looking good now, huh? Sure are, barbarian. Sure are. I think I only need one crackle with power, now that I think of it. Now that I've taken any more than one fucking second to reflect upon this. Alright, I'm actually going to concede to a justice list. We only need one of these. We only need one. We can put in a pair of meat hookers. <laughs> that would be fine. You know, just a pair. A pair of the meats. Uh, but for, first thing I want you to keep in mind, you really, truly need to be careful about conflating the joy of creation with the joy that your game is actually creating. One less here. Two less here. Three of these. So that's the first thing. Um, careful with that. Second, if you're trying to think of making something fun, make it astoundingly less complex than you think. Why? One of the earliest design errors that uh, was pointed out to me, I now point out to everyone that asks or is willing to listen to me, is to go add more simple components instead of deepening a single component. Gween. So what do I mean by this? I mean like, you have a puzzle game where you need to move around and get the red key to open red doors. You feel like that's boring, so you introduce blue keys to unlock blue doors, and green keys to unlock green doors, and yellow keys to unlock yellow doors. And each one of these individually is kind of bland and kind of boring and kind of not really doing anything for you. And so that's the thing to adjust the thing to tune. And first thing, don't confuse the joy of creation with the joy of playing. Start sitting start sitting down after you've been like, oh yeah, it works and that's great, and start actually trying to think through whether or not it's it's awesome. Good job, bud. Good job. Second thing, try to deepen a mechanic. Instead of adding more stuff, try to make it have a little bit more gradation to it, you know? So for instance, a jump where when you're mid-air you can start to steer it a little bit. Or you have, like, some ability to... Hey, look at this. It's working. Woo! Why I'll get this one. I actually think I need to get rid of this and this. Get rid of these thingies entirely. I think we shouldn't have this shambling gas, deadly dispute type base. I think the shambling gas just need to com get completely cut now that I'm looking at it. The third thing, in terms of the funness, um, it's important to have an ability to describe what it is that is fun that you are trying to go for. So I always like to use platformers as an example. If you're like, ooh, aiming and timing things right feels really good. And the need to quickly predict I think is really fun. Get em, boys. I think that's really fun. I don't know what the hell happened. So if you can describe that that's what's really fun about it. Um... Then with your movement mechanics, you actually can describe what it is that you're doing instead of just being like, oh, no, just like gonna make the movement fun. You're like, ooh, if I want some quick approximation in the movement and timing, yeah, that actually feels like I'm making a statement about what it is we're trying to do. 
Yeah, I don't think I need these at all. I think old rut stain is fine. So again, I would encourage you to not conflate the joys of creation with the joys of fun. Two, encourage you to really heavily simplify your idea and make the core of it fun before adding on more bits. Uh, and, and again, this is like a classic early designer mistake where you just suddenly get all excited. Get all excited. He starts to add things to it instead of like actually fixing the problem with the mechanic. You just keep adding mechanics until something works. Third thing I would recommend, have an idea of where the fun is going to come from. And honestly, I think this is, this is the hardest thing to do. But if you just keep repeating yourself, okay, why is this fun? Why is this fun? Why is this fun? Why is this fun? Why would this be fun? Why is this fun? Why would I ever do this? Who gives a shit? Why does it matter? Why is this fun? Why is this fun? Why is this fun? One, two, three, four, five, six. The crawling infestation harness infinity is like totally rad. I think if I just make a whole bunch of cheap removal and then harness infinity instead of having a lot of gas, it's gonna be good. Like for instance, if you were, if we're talking about magic, like you know, and and you ask something about like why is the crawling infestation fun? Like, why is it fun? There's a lot of complex, high-level bullshit that you can intellectualize to the point of, like, missing the forest for the trees, right? Crawling infestation is cool because it kind of reminds you a little bit of bugs, a literal infestation happening. Oh, that's cool. It's like you're making a swarm of bugs from, from dead stuff. Or when a dragon is really big and deals damage, you just imagine a dragon breathing fire, and that's cool. So if you were making a platformer and your character was a dragon, you'd be like, okay, how do I do things that make it feel dragon-like? Why would I want to do that? Because dragons are cool. Ta-da. I really struggled with this for a long time. Because when I started actually doing... Uh, Ooh, yeah. Mill, mill. Mill, mill. Mill. Yeah. Oh, ho, 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 fuck yeah, man. Oh, shit, yeah. Take that, Trainer James. <laughs> All right, it's working. Oh shit, but I still only have one Haunted Ridge. Well, damn. All right. What up, Easy BFT? Ed, 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 how we doing, baby? Wow, oh, he's drawing cards here. Ugh. Again, we don't really care if anything dies. Oh wait, for some reason I I went one plus one plus one equals four. My brain is truly melted. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So fourteen would be enough. Yeah, let's go ahead and mill two points. Doink. Sounds good. Do. All right, so I think that probably let's go ahead and for simplicity do this. Let's go ahead and harness infinity real quick here. <laughs> cool, cool, good, very good. I'm just gonna play the little ones. Is starting to feel pretty good. Oh, 
Alright. Nice. <laughs> I mean, the crawling infestations do feel pretty good with these creatures. And we have three Meat Hook Massacres. Like, I'm, I'm kind of feeling, if I'm being honest, as though I am a genius. And I think I'm... I actually think I might be. I mean, I know that might be a little a little bit arrogante to say, but I mean, I don't think anyone has ever been smarter than I have been. I think we're being real here. Is this homebrew Golgari? Damn right it is. This and this. I'm not taking any damage. I don't want to fucking take damage. Auto pay. Let's sacrifice this this baby here. Bam. He's gonna make a treasure. Dish, dish. Bam, bam. Floop, floop. I feel like we're just gonna right off the top get the Meat Hook Massacre. Let's go ahead and get the dispute. Auto pay. Let's sacrifice this, darling. This. Go ahead and get a treasure token. Yeah, maybe it's actually good to have so much cheap stuff here. There's a lot of infinity harnessing that we can do. Seems pretty good. Tovalar. Yeah, do I want to mill? Yup, mill, mill. Do I want to mill? Yup, mill, mill. Do I want to mill? Yup. Really? I didn't... I didn't hit a single one. I have three meat hook massacres in here. I gotta be honest, I'm, I'm quite annoyed about that. Well. That's all right. So there's a Splendid Reclamation. So if I do this, then I Splendid Reclamation. And then we can still harness Infinity, right? I won't quite have enough. Okay. Probably do this. And before we get milled, I don't know how we can. We're too powerful. So let's go ahead and get the containment breach. Destroy this thing. I think that seems... Seems honestly pretty good. Let's go ahead and do the crawling infestation here. Yeah, no, I think that's... Uh, good. Let's go ahead and hit for one. <laughs> So the win condition here is to crash the client. Uh, that's one of our win conditions, is the client dies. Oh, there's 10 in the graveyard. I misread it. It's 22. So yeah, it's it's totally reasonable that we didn't hit the uh, Meat Hook Massacre. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is a lot more fun than some dumbass Selesnia aggro list. My opponent's trying to do stuff. I'm just not really paying attention. So we're going to be able to draw six. No, seven next turn. Because we're going to mill this much and we just harness infinity with whatever's there. It's our last harness infinity, which is a little bit frustrating. They lose life whenever... Whenever my things get to do stuff. So what has Trample? Trample, haste. So this is it. This is the only one, huh? Get some drawing here. So these guys, these guys, they don't even have Trample. So, I mean, I think we're good, right? My opponent is, unless this can get, like, double-doubled. Right, this is the Trample Haster. Back up to 10. 
So the probability of us not winning this next game is, ex or this next turn is exceedingly small. Um, you know, still doesn't mean, doesn't mean we're going to win, but, you know, it is. So it's just, I just want to state that I'm aware. Of it. I want to state that I'm aware of it. I'm not ignorant of this. I'll mill. There's the meat hook. Hey, there's Crackle of Power. Now, how how many lands are in here? Just the one. Okay, I mean, that's fine. I'll, uh, Splendid Reclamation put one land up. Then I'm going to Harness Infinity. <laughs> then I'm going to play... Where is it? Meat Hook Massacre. Alright, there it is. X equals one. <laughs> okay. I think... <laughs> That's pretty fun. That's I think the deck is working. I think the deck is working. All right. <laughs> so, so let's let's think through what the game plan is again. Let's let's try to describe aloud why we're doing what we're doing here. Uh, like who are we as a person? Um, we're someone who's just trying to slow things down. Should get another pest summoning in there. I think that's probably reasonable. Yeah, I mean, really, it's it's a pretty linear game plan. We just delay, delay, delay until we scoot into Meat Hook Massacre, and if all else fails, we just crackle with power, you know. I think it's working. <laughs> I think that we managed to defeat an aggressive list, which is a positive thing, which is a positive, positive thing for us. I'm, like, happy about us. This is good. This is this is good. This is working. This is working for me. <laughs> Sandy Petunia says there's something so gratifying about seeing the stack rapidly grow. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. All right. Uh, I think we'll just kind of, you know, I think we'll just hang out. I'm just going to say no attacks. I'll eat the Falcon Wrath Pit Fighter. It's fine. It's fine. Just... It's so good. It's so awesome. All right. <laughs> Shoot it. Don't even really care much. Totally fine by me. I think we'll do pest summoning, right? We just want to. We just. We're all about delays of game. Might have been better to not do that, but I don't know. I. We all know I'm a wee bit of a fool. We have one of our two scoot swarms in here. Onto this thing. Oh, Rem Carlos? Oh shit, my meat hook massacres. I mean that is that is a pickle and a half, is it not? I don't think I have a single way to deal with flyers. Mmm, we need to get some flapper answers in there, don't we? I might even just use this blood token. That's pretty good. Yeah, 
I mean, flyers are like a real, a real issue. So we'll probably do this into um, finding Landos. We got a meat hook massacre somewhere in here. One, two, three, four. All right, so this is this is this is the play. <clears throat> so we're just gonna we're just gonna smack our opponent on the following turn. That'll be good. I hope, I hope villain swings out. I sincerely hope it. All right, we're still able to harness infinity. I love that this is instant speed, you know that. I'm just so into this. Ah, Shaun of the Scalds, okay. Oh shit, that's pretty significant. Let's go ahead and swap through these things, yep. Seems good, all right into the bin with that one. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so we're going to we're going to x equals 3 this first. So this will kill all those, we'll gain a bunch of life. Bada 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 bada. Healing on up. Let's go ahead and replay one of these puppies. Bang. Go ahead and not swing. So we now have two Harness Infinities down, but our next Harness Infinity that we get is going to be quite nice. We do need some redundancy because it's kind of a bit of an issue to... You know, we might run that flashback card that lets me shuffle things back into my deck. Ooh, that's pretty sick. Holy shit, we won. <laughs> I, I'm very surprised to see this screen right now. This is bizarre to me, I'm not gonna lie. Uh huh. Balaged recovery, great call, Joe Sock. That's exactly what we need. All right. All right, so we will peel off one of these. Get Balaged recovery. You know, I might just peel them both off and go like this, huh? So we have 24 prime landies. Makes Splendid Reclamation slightly weaker, but then again, I'm the most powerful player here. Is it Balaged Recovery or Galabed Recovery? Oh my god, we... We drew it! We drew, we did we've drawn the nuts. The Balabed. The <laughs> Balaget indeed, hell yeah. <laughs> this deck is just giving me life. It's a gr it's a green list. And look at this. Crawling infestation. This is gonna just Give us so many more resources. If you think I'm... If you think I'm not chumping, you're crazy. This is the whole purpose of these shambling geists. Shambling geist gas whenever you... Oh. Sure. Ow. Ow. Oh. Alright, let's grab a treasure token. We also run a whole lot of little... Baby creatures. Ooh. 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 
Ooh, that's not. This is not good. This is not good. We we kind of wanted to mill a creature. Blessing of Frost. Distribute counters. Oh my god, we're getting shunned for like a billion. That's not good. Alright. Mill mill. Oh, we literally died. Okay, okay. I feel like we just got unlucky. You know, we might not even need the red for Crackle with Power, but we're definitely going to run the red for Crackle with Power. Did not come together. Well, I mean, magic is a game of probabilities. And probabilistically speaking, this deck is probably great. <laughs> oh my god, it's nearly perfect. Except for the part where it's like awful. But we're gonna run it. How many creatures are we running? Running some. I actually think these deadly disputes. Is it Balaged or is it Gal? Is, is it at, like if you go to a gala and you want to take a nap, you know, you lie down on the gala bed? <laughs> I think it's a gala bed recovery. Like because sometimes I don't know if like your gala capsized, something you know bad happened at your gala. You want to be able to recover all of the beds that you lost there, and that's when you would cast the Gala Bed Recovery. Rider Guitarist says, boo. Well, boo right back at you, Rider Guitarist. I say a pun, you roll your eyes, and I stand up, I'm like, hey, fuck you, Rider Guitarist. <laughs> Don't you fucking ever say that shit to me. Alpen says, crackle with power over Inferno the Star Mounts. Well, 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 if it is an Alpen 112 coming back. We don't need this stupid, stupid deadly dispute. We don't. The great mess is I think you're stretching this a bit. No, no. I'm just, I'm just changing this. I don't even want to play the stupid list with this stupid deadly dispute. This is a terrible card. I'm not gonna run it. Why would I run it? The card sucks. All right, uh, Golgari Crack. All right, let's see here. If I peel these deadly disputes, okay. So if I if I if I peel this, what are some other uh, what are some other mill cards that are creatures that actually seem sensible for us? Egon might be fine. Maybe Undead Butler is pretty rad, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, maybe Death Bonnet Sprout's actually pretty tight. I'm gonna give it a go. To give it a go. Hold on, I'm computing something. 
I think I might actually want four of these dum dums. Four, ten. Three is probably. figure out like how I just want the last few pieces of this unbelievably idiotic thing to work. Nah, I think I think this is really good. I think I want more one mana things. I think it's really good. Big lines then says is it okay not to have any draw? We kind of have draw. We kind of do. Kind of do. Via Harness Infinity. And via filling our grave up with stuff. And uh, having learn cards. Things like this. That, that actually give us some very legful maneuvers. Alright, we're playing Haunted Ridge and this is black, black, and green. Voice of the Blessed! Oh! Exiles. I just want to get rid of this voice of the blessed. Dig up gives you what you want. That's an interesting one, Mirrodin 81. That's a very interesting suggestion. Suggestion. Leon and War Leader? What year is it? Perfect. Oh. Oh, yeah. Dude, if this thing bends a creature, we are golden. Glad I'm running four of these. A bunch of these and three of those. is just going to completely shit on it. Oh my god. Ooh, ah. Ugh. Ah, Trellisar. Jeez, Trellisar, Trellisar. What the fuck? Holy shit. What the? Oh my god. That is ridiculous. Mill two cards? Yeah. Oh yeah. I didn't fucking mill a creature. I can't believe it. Can't believe it, and I don't believe it. Felisar just she, she hammered us, man. It sucks. Okay, we won. We won. We can't lose this. This is an unlosable situation. Unlosable. It's unlosable. Great message. This seems to be a pretty consistent problem, not hitting creatures. Careful. Careful. Because we have played one game since we've added Death Bonnet Sprout and upped the creature count by a bunch. Played one game. Played one damn game! And there's yet more ways that we can improve and adjust. I think the simplest one is to do minus two of these plus two eye twitches. Very simple. Boom! There it is. Creature in the graveyard. Suck on that, haters. No. Man, no. Yeah, you don't know what I'm running, do you, huh? 
All right, time to hunt for some specimens. Uh, I think the environmental sciences. I think just ramping up is still good. No attacks. Trade roofing. thing. All right. All right. No blocks. I'll I'll, I'll take a little pain. I want to keep my death bonnet sprout going. All right. We got we got a guy in the bin. Professor of Symbology. Hmm. Graveyard's filling up with lands. Oh, yeah, baby. Let's get a green one. That seems pretty nice, huh? Okay. Be taking a wee bit of damage, but not like a lot of damage. Like, not a lot. We're getting close to a scoot swarm activation. Like, good things are happening for us. Now, there's a completely alternative way to build this deck, which is that I just basically cut the creatures. Like, entirely. And we instead lean more heavily on being just a traditional control stylist. I will definitely do this. Start ramping it up. And start to get really wide. <laughs> Dude, can you imagine the power of X equals one? Like, can you can you imagine that? Actually, I should I should get some of these things in here. Yeah, I actually this is this is forgot about this guy. Oh, that's gonna be a good addition. Ooh yeah. Ooh ooh ooh. Well, I even know exactly how we're gonna do this too. I'm just gonna peel these hunt for specimens out. See you later, alligator. Ow, ow. Bong. Uh oh, villain sees a harness infinity and kinda gives me one more we're, you know we're still we're still just hanging on. Yeah, I gotta get some fell stingers here. This is so good. Dude, don't you just love to see Harness Infinity in the bin? Harness Infinity in the binity? No, I don't I don't I don't need any blocks here, man. My opponent's gonna sweep me before I sweep them. <laughs> Shit. Oh my god! Dude, the death touch creature is just smacking it right now. So, what do we need? We need... Crackle of power. Now, if I can start getting enough land up in here... Oh, dude, I, I have such... You can play Meat Hook for zero? Oh, absolutely. I'm gonna go ahead and... One, two, three, four... Beep, beep. Uh, if we can get more land out, if we can get 14 land out. 14 land is the money. It's the money one -y. And I actually think, like, oh, dude, this this creature is just going to be perfect. This guy, the Fell Stinger. Draws two cards and loses two life. You oh, my God. Deal with this annoyance. Deal with this annoyance. Hey, kitten. Hey, sweetie pie. Hello, sweetie pie. All right, excuse me. All right. All right, hey. Yo. All right, okay. We have a cat on the loose and an incredible deck about to get made. Army. This 
is Despy. I love you! Despy! I love you! Oh, we're purring hard. Alright. Oh, oh shit, yeah, we got shambling ghasts for days. I'm actually gonna concede. Um, alright, excuse me, sweetheart. No, 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 I, I have the key. I have the key. Let's, let's not. Let's not and say we did. Alright. Alright. Hello. Oh, she's so good. She's such a good cat. Oh, what a good cat. Yeah, oh, yeah. Okay, now stay there. Stay there. Okay, yep, I love you. Now, watch this. Hunt for specimens. Gone. Eye twitch. Bam, bam. Alright, okay. Let's, let's not and say we did. Come on, let go. Alright, so we've pulled these things out. Oh my god, I'm actually gonna peel one of these. And then I'm gonna peel one of these. And then we're gonna put in these ex exploit babies. There it is, Felstinger. Ba da da da. Ba da da da. Is there a way to. Because we should have 24 lands, and then this is the 25th. I think that's okay. This is this is wrong. This is wrong. This is right because with this one, this is this solves the sort of core problem that we're having issues around with and against. And I want to skew it more towards the eye twitch because we have multiple ways to sack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, this is it. Um, we could actually go down to two hunt for specimens and put another battle get recovery, but I don't think we need to. No, no, this is it. This is it. This is it. This is the list. This is where things turn on. Hello. We're doing it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is my cat. Isn't she neat? Do, 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 do. <laughs> I love my fucking cats. Look at this cat. Isn't she neat? Wouldn't you think her collection's complete? All right. I go first. Uh, not good enough. We have a lot of one mana babies. Hmm. Yeah, I'll hang on to this and I'll put this little crackle of power over there. But this this hand right here, now this, this hand is good enough. Look at her little look at her little paws just like making bread. Oh yeah. Oh. oh, we're gonna play the haunted ridge. Here, let me continue to hold your hand. Oh my god, dude, this cat is like so fucking sick. Look at this cat. This cat's just the sickest little buddy ever. Oh my god, yes. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh the scritchies. Oh yes, the scritchies. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, scritches are so fucking sick. Oh my god. Oh. Dude, this is awesome. Yeah, this cat is literally shaking my whole body with purrs. Oh, this is this is heaven. This is little cat heaven right here. Oh, let's go ahead and play a crawling infestation and then my opponent is like, "What? Do I counter that? Do I not?" You're doing a good job. Oh, we're rubbing the tummy now? We're rubbing the tummy? I'm holding this? Oh, we're scratching the tum. Oh, we're getting the tummy scratches. These are some off-camera tummy scratches. Tummy pats. Oh, yes. Look at that paw go out. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. It's so ridiculous. Look at this arm. What is this arm doing? Oh, yeah. Oh, now we want to chew on the headphones. Nope. Nope. Not a chance. Not a chance, huh? Oh, you got cat hair all over my face. Yeah, no, I'm right here. I'm right here. <laughs> oh, shit. Look at this witch. Hold on. I gotta mill these two cards. Hold on. Stay here. Let me take this action. 
Rats. Ah, yes. Generating 1-1s. One Two can play at that game. Dude, look at my cat. Oh, oh, she just loves the chin. She, oh, she fucking loves this little chin. Oh, it's so fucking sick. Oh, my God. Oh, yes. Oh. Oh. Mm, 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 mm. I love doing stupid shit like this, man. I want people to do this with their kids. All right, you a cat? Now, I think the control matchups are going to be the hardest. Nope, let's not go for the headphones. Let's not and say we did, huh? Oh, dude. Mill it. Mill it. Oh my god, the skill. Look at this skill. Isn't it neat? I'm gonna go ahead and get my, my, my brand new insect that just came to life. That's how that works? No way, that's how that shit fucking works? Oh my god. I did not know that shit at all. I know, it freaked me out. Hey, Dis. Getting a little annoyed. Sedgemoa Witch. Oh my god. Oh my god, this guy's trying to overwhelm me with one one. So, oh my god. This has Menace, which is a real pain in the ass. I think it makes it an excellent, excellent control card. All right, no blocks. Doesn't want to swing with one of these because I will kill those for sure. Lock, lock. My opponent is, like, low on stuff. This is good. Yep, mill, mill. Shit, yeah. Hold on, hold on, let me... Okay, 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 ow, 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 ow. Okay, do we still have... Alright, good stuff. God, I fucking... Cat hair all over me. Environmental seances. Dude, let's just see if Oma... Oh, yeah. Green, 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 black, black, black. Perfect. Alright. Wit. Let me tell you something. As someone that has made it through lockdown and the pandemic, I am a master at getting wide. <laughs> I eat my feelings. Yep. All right, take action, take action. Good shit. Yeah. I mean... All right, uh, draw 14 is pretty good. All right, so let me, let's see here. So what we want to do is we want to play the Balagued Recovery, because that'll make a lot of scoots. And we should have Splendid Reclamation right there. So we're going to not attack. Discard the land, discard six cards, the land, the land. Um, probably the thing that gives us lands... Bell Stinger. Hunt for specimens and hunt for specimens. Alright, that's pretty good. Look at this scoot swarm. Isn't it neat? Oh my god, yes. Oh, ooh. Mill, mill. I'm a very lucky boy. 
All right, let's go ahead and play first the Scoot Swarm. I think that's probably the play. And then what we'll do is probably play Splendid Reclamation to get <laughs> all these lands. <laughs> uh, oh, it's fucking hilarious, man. May as well get this one down. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the space bar button. <laughs> Oh, we are figuring out the meta. Ah, oh, it's so good. Let's see, how much land do we have? We actually have enough. We can harness infinity again. It's lethal. It's actually lethal two ways. We can attack and probably kill them. But in particular, we can also probably just get the meat hook massacre to bop it. Look at that. Made another little insect pal, huh? Mm-hmm, that's right. I'm telling you, I think we solved it. I think we figured out the fiddly bits of this deck and we're winning now. God, did we draw the best possible hand? I think maybe we did. See, this is why we have a lot of one-mana utility creatures in here, you know? Do this, and then this is... Oops, we did this wrong, because this... We need a green source. Well, that's fine, we'll hunt for specimens. Cleric of Life Spawn? Okay. So this is a cleric list. They're trying to go for some really long-term value, but I personally really like going for long-term value. Excalion says, I think this deck may have a few bugs. Nice. Very nice. Very excellent. Prosperas in Kipa. Lunar Veteran. Perfect. I'm going to go ahead and play the Haunted Ridge. Hmm. Actually, we... See, this is the problem with the, with the green source. We got the Haunted Infestation. Or Crawling Infestation. Excuse me. ay 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 We have just making such a big mistake. -y. Away my breath is taken. Terminus Thrall. Good to see ya. It says, oof, 6 to 7.15 meeting today. Oh, that's some content right there, baby. Uh, let's not to increase your thighs, do stuff. Okay, let's do this. So, I mean, we, we're, we're just in hang and stall mode. Oh, no, uh, we're actually, we're in, we're in hang and fry mode. But that's okay, that's okay. We, we have a way to deal with this 4-6 of Alkity. We have to block here. So that will die. So we can make a treasure token. And then we will take action. Mill, mill. Mill the creature. Very nice. So then what we're going to do is we're going to play this. We're going to meet, or, uh, so we hunt for specimens. We're going to find necrotic fumes so that way we can pick off this while sacrificing this it's kindly made by the crawling infestation the cleric of life's bond is a problem because life will continue to get gained what I was wanting to do Well, we actually might be okay. We might be okay. We might be okay. No, 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 no. This thing, life is gained. Life is gained. Never mind. We're, in a way, quite sweet. 
going to take like eight. Not the ideal circumstances at all. Let's go ahead and mill. Mill. We didn't. We didn't hit it. All right. Old rut stain might actually buy us the necessary time we need. Especially if we mill a land. Oh, okay. We got one of those. Almost got the Splendid Reclamation out. It's just a big pickle. Just a big old pickle, you know? Let's see. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. If we go seven, eight, still not enough. Second one. I think we just like. I, I I I'm not actually sure how the stack works here. We needed to get this just like one stupid frock and turn earlier. Frock. Um. That was close. Yeah, I believe that um, mine goes on the stack first, theirs goes on the stack second. Which means that theirs resolve first and mine resolve second. Alright, cool. Alright, now I actually think that it can, that game loss can all be traced back to, I really gotta make sure I'm doing this properly, to that turn one play. I mean, literally it was the turn one play that prevented us from playing our enchantment on turn cruel, turn cruel, excuse me, turn two. I said turn cruel because someone typed cruel in chat and my brain is like, bah, and just repeats what I see. Um, all right, I'm going to environmental sciences because we are up against what appears to be blue-black control. See, island and shipwreck marsh turn one. Yeah, nice. All right, so let's do this. We get a swamper. this. Yeah, pretty basic, pretty basic. Yeah, but I mean, we, we messed up that land, and I was complaining about that for a few turns. That was going to be a real pain for us. Oh, Visionary Stitcher. Wait, what? What? Alright, well. We're in Necrotic Fuma, huh? Zombies have flying. Wow, that's sick. Well, I mean, we'll get to exile this, which is good. I would be surprised if they had a lot of counter magic in there, but... I'm okay being wrong. Yeah, I guess uh, flying zombies are going to own us. Oh, sick. Okay, so we kind of need exactly Meat Hook Massacre. Do you think we can get it? Think we can get it? I think we got this. I think, wait, here it is, right off the top.
Okay, bye-bye. Yeah, I mean, like, a horde of early flyers, I think we 100% lose to. Almost always. Alright. Alright. Looks like the game wants me to see this art. Okay, cool. So close. Yeah, it was so close. It was so close. Like, we're, we're losing, but I think... Any chance of best of three? Nah, I mean, I'm using seven of the sideboard slots for learning and lessons, so... Alright. We go first, though. It's good enough for me. All right, this is, we're, oh my God, this is perfect. All right, okay, okay. Okay, I think it's, everything's gonna be okay. This, this black, okay, great, 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 great. We're against mono black, perfect. We're gonna get some blood vials, nice. Excellent. Yep, yeah, okay. So this could get out of control. This is a death toucher. Nice. Okay, nice. Very good. Into the bin with you. Blood tokens. Some of the worst cards we can get. But that's okay. We're not bitter at all. No bitterness here. Only absolute positivity. Oh, actually, I should have triggered that. I can, because I can bend this. Chandler gassed. So we needed X equals three this on this turn, huh? Let's go ahead and root this one. Nice, excellent. No blocks. No two cards, yeah. Oh yes. Perfect. Rut stain staying in. Perfect. No. Alright, he's out. I'm not paying attention. Silly mistakes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, if we draw land here, this is gonna be sick. Mm-hmm. Let's do it. Oh my god. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh my god, yes. Easy. Easy. You don't have two instant speed removal spells. Holy shit, Rotten Reunion to delete a land. You love to see that sort of maneuver. You love to see it. Yes! Oh my god, it's so great. Alright, and they're out of there. Dude, we have the plays. I think we figured it out. I think it's really good. Oh my god, my neck is finally starting to feel better. From that juicy neck strain, baby. All right, here we go. Let's fight. Let us fight. Let us fight. Good old rust stain. All right. Um, it's a clumsy hand, but we know how to. We know how to do clumsy hands. It's like not a deal. Neck strain, indeed. I have some strain in my neck. I have some neck stains. Usher fall. This, this is an ideal run out. So we'll probably want 
green on this one now that I think of it. We'll do this and we'll just go ahead and pick up an environmental sciences. Look at this. We're about to go up against a meta deck. This is incredible. We're against the meta white weenie, huh? Ah, Sunpa problem. I'm gonna go ahead and get all rut stained down there. No. Sean puts the pro in pronunciation. <laughs> ah, yes, good, good, good. All right, intrepid adversary. Oh, Adeline respond to Okay, sure, 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 I think so. Mill, mill. Mill, mill. Okay. Now here's the thing that is hilarious. I can actually crackle with power for one and just pick this guy off. Like, how, what, how ridiculous does this look to our opponent right now? Like, what is going on in Day 9's brain over here, right? <laughs> like, we look like an insane person. And that's the allure. Yeah, this is it. This is the hand. This is the game. We're real close, let me tell you. We're real close to being able to just harness some infinites. We have a chump in the skies. Oh my, what a guy. We'll just eat this one up, no big deal. All right. No mill. There's the harness infinity. Nasty. And I think I know what I'm going to do here, too. Which just feels incredible. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, you fucking dick, man. Oh, that's my that's my whole exhibition, man. Ah, uh, what a jerk. All right. Take the action. Fine, fine. Interesting. Very, very interesting here, huh? You know, this is probably better to do in the long run, is to just smash this thing down, even though it puts me a turn behind. I think it's prob probably, probably, plausibly a good thing to do. Because, I mean, if I simply draw a Splendid Reclamation, like, the game is over. Sun go, Sentinel. What do you even, what do you even target here? What do you even target? Like, Bear Don played the card and is like, I, pff, just, pff. please hit me. Good, ow, I like the pain. Yeah, we always we always take this option. Well. Whenever a creature you control dies, each 
want to lose a life whenever we kill an enemy creature. I gain one life. Okay. Alright. Oh, you just intrepid away. Oh, absolutely. Like 100% do this block. We have both of our basics now. Gotcha. Always. Nice, we get a little insect. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Fucking rad. Alright. Very hard to draw poorly right now. Very hard. It's in fact, one of those difficult things I've ever done is to try to draw poorly here. <laughs> okay, I'll fuck. Yeah, man. Get out of here. Yeah, bye bye. <laughs> We're chuckling around pretty. I'm indestructible! <gasps> oh, oh, oh. Bang. What do you exile? It's like no one knows for sure. So we got our blood vial. That'll help us a little bit. Do I want a mill too? Yeah, sure. I'll make a little insect guy. Let's go. You know, this is probably one of the only ones that I actually don't care much for here. Well, that's... That's truly terrible. Block with you, ever. Alright, so this just, just means that villain has to kind of, like, basically swing out this turn. That is okay. This deck, Sean's own creation, it sure is, F. Gandalf. I have to swing with the Intrepid Adversary, huh? Because my opponent is at 11. Alright, let's go ahead and say, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, me have massacred have been. Dude, I've not even gotten to cast a Fell Stinger. Ah, yes, good old Rut Stain. Is that my last Harness Infinity? We got another one in there. So, we now have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 total attackers. We gotta swing with these two. Blood! Let it through. It's fine. My opponent can swing for eight in the air. Over there, like you just don't care. It takes one for each block due to Mita. Nice. If creature you control dies, you're gonna lose one life. Sick. Alright, cool. We get to pick off these two. Alright. Red. Hexproof from red. Nice. Meat Hook is a good card. You know, th that's like that horrifying scene in the comic Cross where the guy, like, sprinkles salt in front of the the cross, because he believes he has, he's superstitious and thinks that this will stop it, and instead the guy just they just kill him and his family. <laughs> it's like horrifying. So let's see. Five, six, seven. Two. Alright, so this is five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 12. Attacking. 12. My opponent will block 2. 10. 10 damage. My opponent will heal. Get him. Do 
So he says, oh, he's messing around then, that's cool. No, 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 I just, I literally missed it. <laughs> Alright, you got it. It's yours. I mean, the deck is too meta. Perfect zero. All right, let's keep let's keep climbing on up, baby. All right. The game's giving me cards. I don't need cards. I only need to hit the find match button. Oh, there's a new Age of Empires 2 patch. Hell yeah. Wow. These are like, these are some big ass patches. Alright, let's do it in order. Oh, it's one of these fucking things, huh? Okay, well, all right. I'll do this, and this. Is, is Jadar not a... Oh, shit. That is not what I was expecting. Hit him with some science, baby. So, I, I feel very close to Doom here. Like, these lists just go under really hard and really fast. Dude, I have not cast a fell Stinger more than once. Like, not more than once. Tilt is real. Well, that helps some. Green! No. I mean, the problem is that Champion of the Parish is going to be a pickle. It's going to be a big pickle. The pickliest. Prickliest and pickliest. Also, just missing land a whole bunch of times in a row is the pickliest. Like this. So, Cossack Sports, did you see the AOE for blog post, roadmap, dev commentary thing posted earlier today? I saw some of it. I saw some of it. I want to go back and actually take a, a deeper peek. Uh, I'm just going to make a treasure token because I think that in the long run it'll be better. So, if I can outrace this with rut stains and lands and treasures and shit, that'd be good. All right. If this gets countered, I'm just I can win. Yeah, I mean, I mean, if you don't draw a lane, you're screwed. Uh, yeah, let's actually take a peek at the end of the uh, at the end of the little show here. Reddit.com slash AOE4. Oops. I hate the autocomplete sometimes. It's like I type it in. It's like, ah, oh, you want this specific thread on Reddit, not that subreddit. I just type it. Okay. 
Okay, and I think that, that is good enough. link to it right now, Sil Catham. I'm on the hunt for it. Alright, so let's do... Hey, is this... Oh, no, it's not my list. Aww. Hunt for Spacemans. Alright, so what we are going to do is we are going to smash down. Alright, come on. Come on. We're against Danger Dan. All right, you got it. You got it, Danger Dan. It's good. It slows down there. Gameplay plan a bit. I'm just gonna exploit draw my own. Just, no, I'm not. I'm doing this. Woo! Crawling infestation. No one wants to counter this. Does links work here. A silk app. Generally speaking, we we want to encourage you to ask for permission before posting a link. But in this case, I specifically asked for it, so that's okay. Take this action. All right, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll take a peek at it again in a momento. So, perfect. We're starting to fill this bin. So, now look at this. Look at the crawling infestation. Oh, yeah. Sacrifice a creature. Boom. This creature draws two cards and looks like bam, bam. Boom. Bam. All right, that feels really good. So, guys, says, ah, apologies. No, no, no. You, you, you're terrific, Silcath. I just wanted to... Kind of call that out uh, for other people that are just like, oh, it's link time. It's linky time. All right. All right. Teachings of dim archaics. If we, like, draw a land, play Rutstain, and hit a... Hit a land with Rutstain... I'm pretty sure this is pronounced Rutstein, but... Woo, we get to scoot, scoot, be boo. Heading in. Linking leads to banning. Yes, linkliness is next to deathliness. I'm really excited we're having date night. I'm just fucking so excited. I don't I don't know why. I actually don't know why I'm so excited, but I'm like really excited. I'm going to go on a date. Oh, I think it's because there's going to be no pets there. Like, don't get me wrong. I have lovely, lovely little babies. You know, I'm just going to do this. This gets countered. Oh. <laughs> All right, nice. Superb. Alright, let's go ahead and hit in the air. Here, and here, and there. No reason not to attack, even though I didn't previously. And then I do this wall! My opponent's gonna take seven turns in a row. Marlon 19 says, I'd be super excited about date night. I love my kids more than anything, but also miss spending time with my wife. Ha ha. Yeah, right? Oh my god, spending time with your spouse is fucking sick, man. I would in fact describe it as overpowered. Oh. 
Our Pivoting! Yeah, dude, I'm gonna call it. Oh my god. Your spouse OP, please don't nerf. Yeah, my spouse needs no nerf. Cult Gluttons, did you see the new infinite resources bug in AoE 4? Yeah, Cult Glutton, that's fucking good. There is an upgrade that increases the health of your buildings, and therefore, um, okay, so when a structure is is built, it deducts money from you in Age of Empires. So if I want to make a 150, um, oh, if I want to make another uh, barracks, it costs 150, so I make the barracks, it's 150. Gold, or 150 wood that's deducted from you. Now let's imagine it's finished. When buildings take damage in Age of Empires, you can uh, assign workers to repair them, but it costs you money. And how much the building um, repair cost is, that's proportional to how much it cost, um, or how much the building cost is. So there's an upgrade that makes buildings sturdier, and as a result, makes them cost more money. But if you get this upgrade and you spend the money to make a structure, but then decide you actually want to cancel building that structure. Canceling construction refunds you the money, but because you've upgraded the building so it now has a higher value. Okay, each player chooses a non-land permanent they control. Return all non-land permanents not chosen this way to their owner's hand. Then you draw a card for each opponent who has more cards in hand than you. I mean, it's fine if this one comes back. You know, this one's staying. But again, if you start a structure that then has this um, strength upgrade added in... Oh, yeah, we're, we, we, we always mill, baby. So, again, you build a structure in Age of Empires 4. Build the structure in Age of Empires 4, dude. And you cancel it, it gives you back more money than the cost is after you have this upgrade. So you can build, cancel, 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 build, cancel. And you'll just generate infinite resources. <laughs> so many bugs. Age of Empires 4 is like a buggy game, man. All right. A lot of Alruns epiphanies here. Bye, little Scooty. Okay, bye-bye. La 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 la. SB Television says, man, I'm really surprised at how many of these bugs sound like rookie mistakes, even if they're not. Um, I, 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 I'm baffled. I literally do not have a clue what the heck's going on. It, it simply does not make any sense to me. That was a close game. Yeah, dude, the, the, the Age of Empires 4 is buggy in a way that a released product that costs $60 should not be buggy. Like, very buggy. <laughs> There's, like, so many other bugs like this. Because, I mean, like, here's the thing. I, I actually kind, I kind of don't mind bugs being in a product. But if they're starting to get picked off one by one quickly with hotfixes, I'm like, yeah. Yeah, Alrun's Epiphany fucking sucks, man. Fuck that card.
Oh my god, as if things couldn't get any better in this draw. Ooh! Yeah, but I mean, like, um, Age of Empires 4 is buggy in a way that just, it should not be buggy. If anyone was doing, like, any reasonable quantity of QA. And in particular, like, there's bugs that should get hotfixed. Like, in StarCraft 2, you could, like, load a bunker into a command center, and it was just, like, hotfixed. It was just, like, immediately, like, you open the game, it was, like, patched, and it was fine. Like, in a game whose... Because, I mean, this would be, like, a bug in Magic the Gathering if you could draw infinite cards and untap infinitely. Like, no one would ever say, yeah, no, seems fine. They would be like, holy shit, the whole core thing in the game. Like, dude, you can get you can get literally infinite resources in Age of Empires 4. And again, not not in a complex way. Build, cancel, build, cancel, build, cancel, build, cancel, build, cancel, build, cancel. Oh, hell yeah. Give me them treasures. Give me them insects. Mill two cards. Bing, bang. Boom. Making treasure. Pop. Dude. Crawling infestation will harness infinity is fucking sick. <laughs> Dr. Charms is at least with replays, you can easily catch people who do that and report them, right? So I've been in situations that had broken systems. And when people are desperate... And I mean, like, when I say desperate, I mean, like, gamer desperate. In other words, not real desperation. But, like, boy, do I, I feel like... Situation calls for desperate measures. So, you know, what's... You know, I'm just going to go ahead and play this idiot. So, like, what do I mean? If you're playing a game, and it's been an hour-long game, and you're broke. And it's just like, well, I think my opponent is using the infinite resource bug. Uh, well, there's no way to tell, because this game doesn't have revealed maps and that much information. Oh, man. Uh, you know what? I'm going to use it, too. And then your opponent goes, oh shit, I think my opponent's using the infinite bug. I gotta use the infinite bug. I remember when I was in high school, there was a ladder. I was like 15 or something at the time. And there was this ladder where people had been pointing out in the week leading up to the end of the ladder, like, guys, win trading is gonna be a huge problem on this ladder because it's like top 32 in the ladder. Um gets into the final round and the verification process was just busted my hand looks fucking idiotic i love it all right let's go guys oh this is gonna be good This is, is going to be bad. I mean, I'll run, I'll run, star mounts. But yeah, like so. So I was playing on this ladder, and I mean, it was at the point where it was like the final day, and literally all the players who were like on the bubble of the top thirty-two just started win trading, and you could get a win in about a minute. Because the way that they verified it was they took the uploaded replay and saw if the score was above a certain amount, and outside of that. It was just, it was valid. So everyone was like, win trading. And I was like, well, fuck. Like, this is the big qualification tournament. Like, I guess I have to fucking win trade if I just want to be in the top 32. It was, and it's one of these things that's just, like, fucking terrible. Because, I mean, you're seeing someone win, like, 40 games in an hour. 
<laughs> and suddenly all the players are winning like 40 games in an hour. And a StarCraft game is about 10, 15 minutes long. All right, we got this. All right, here we go. All right. Now, this is one of these blue lists with no counter magic. It's going to surprise your pal, Sean. Rats. How much time left for the stream? Like 10, 15 minutes, Rusty Copernese. Now, there is an alternate way of building this deck, clone. Which is where I pull out this. And... Let's see here. Actually, maybe let's do it like this. Let's 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 get the fell stingers back in here, and let's just do something quite simple. Uh, power word kill, right? And all right, this is this is just a pretty basic change. Pretty basic. Do I dislike the alternate card styles? I don't like my when my deck doesn't match. I think this is actually an okay hand. Going first. Alright, perfect. Mono White, the test. Paradox Fiesta. Well, it's always played catch when I can. Sincerely, a YouTube goblin. Oh my god, I love the. That's so sweet of you to refer to yourself as a goblin. As you should. It's just like, it's just so easy. It's just such an easy, fun joke, you know what I mean? Have we died? You know, I'm, I'm just going to exploit this guy. And draw these cards. We're trying to get that meat hook. I think everything's gonna be fine. Chris Goose form with Dollhouse. Uh, it's hard to see how the whole deck would come together. Bang. Lion's line, there's something, something interesting there. Something interesting there. Exile card from a graveyard and play a land or cast a spell for shares. Okay. Grasp is really good. Go ahead and play this. I'm gonna go ahead and shoot the cemetery vector just right now. Bang. 
Yeah, I think we just maybe needed some instant speed removal. I think we needed it. No attacks necessary. Okay, I'm seeing a pattern of pain here. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh, that's gonna be fucking cool. All right, well, because this is three, four, five. I have to make the exchange here. Will gain us a life. It's cool. Like gaining life. I'm going. Let's take this action. We didn't get an insect. Oh, well, that's. Oh, well, that's terrible. It's terrible. Up to three, you know? Up to three, huh? Oh, come on, we were close. <laughs> come on, we were pretty close. You know, I have never had such fun tumbling backwards on the ladder. Like, this is, this is legitimately awesome. Do, 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 do. Play. And Sharon has yet to make a one-one. I mean, it's made it actually pretty consistently, and I've I've been very pleased. I think it's a it's a beautiful card, and I'm proud to have it. <laughs> Oh my god, this is... I mean, this is... You know what, Felix the Cat? Just you wait and see, okay? Just you wait. Oh, we're gonna make... We're gonna make you look such a fool. But in, in like... In just one quick moment, because I'm gonna have to play old... Rut Stain first. Boom. So much blood. So much blood. We're just making all sorts of blood stains, baby. Ow. Get a block out of you. Oh my god, insects getting made every single day. Alright, well. Well. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do this. And I'm gonna cycle this on the Scoot Swarm, because I'm like so brave. I'm like the bravest you'll ever see. This guy doesn't even know what this card does. You see him hovering? Agony. Agony. Yeah, I got the Mulan soundtrack stuck in my head. It's, it's cause for alarm. It's cause for alarm. Baby, I'll make a man. I know it's not the exact lyrics, but I. I couldn't, I couldn't possibly care any less than I care right now. All right, uh, Scoot Swarm, bye-bye. Watch this. Block, block. Looks like we're not going to get nothing done, right? Here's what's going to happen. Land in the bin, land in the hand. Watch this. I'm going to put this on top. Oh, shit. Boom, insect. Land in the hand. Halfway there. See, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Look at this. You just told me it wouldn't happen. It happened. It happened, not Felix the Cat. Ranger class. Engar. Rangar. I draw a card. Dorcas. My name is Face Up Sean. All right. Do I care? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. We literally have two shots at it, man. Let, let, let's gamble. All right. Mill, mill, 
Boom, look at that. Two insects made, no problem. Bing bong. Oh my god, it feels unfucking believable. Here it is. One, two, three, four, bam, boom, bop, bang, whoosh. Bada, 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 bada. Trigger, 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 trigger. Do, 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 do. It's incredible. Do, 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 do. Now, Felix the Cat says, maybe it happened because I said it. Maybe. Or you've been wrong the whole time. <gasps> That's right. Look out, not Felix the Cat. I'm coming for you. Essica's chariot. No! I can't wait to harness some infinity, man. Let me tell you. Crawling infestation with harness infinity is like a bad combo that feels good. All right, let's mill those cards. Do I want to take that action? Can I click any more clearly, please? We said the last two hours have been the best two hours of this whole stream. I twitch. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. All right, well, I mean, I have no other choice than to just pass it along. Oh, my. God, it's going to be a good turn. It's going to be good stuff. All right. Pash. I have a passion for Pash. The first clue? Dude, I mean, I can't believe how good this turn is going to feel. Primalo on TV says, Sean, you're looking awfully cute today. Thanks, Primalo. Ran in seven. Don't even care. Don't even care. It doesn't even matter to me. Those who the forest. I literally the forest. could not care any less than I care right now. This guy has no clue what's coming, does he? He made a copy of the cat? Oh, that's so funny. Like, what could Day-9 possibly be having here? God, it's just, I can't wait. Ooh, I actually think I made a mistake. I needed to do this, like, last turn. Lands in there. Lands in there. Discard the land. Land. The land. The land. The land. The one that draws more cards. The one that draws more cards. The one that draws more cards. See, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. There it is. There it is. More insects, thereby proving not Felix to cat wrong twice in one turn. I'm what's known as a hater slayer. I'm here, I'm here to get them all. Are you ready? Are you ready? Here's the thing. I actually think Crackle with Power is completely unnecessary for this list. And I think it has a substantial burden of inconsistency to our completely awesome list. Alright. I'm sorry, do you want to copy? Ah, there we go. Sorry, which one? That one? Oh, I'm sorry, which, which one? This one? Oh. 
like a dead guy. Out of the tree foo. In life? Okay. I know you've all been waiting for it. I know you've all been waiting for it. It's gonna happen. Mmm. It's nothing. Nothing can be done for Draco. Cast that at any time, man. It's fine. Alright, let's mill. Let's go ahead and take these actions. Alright, that's good. Take that action. Seems good. Let's go ahead and put this down first. Prepare by doubling a lot. Let's go ahead and put all the lands in our graveyard, which is this many <laughs> out. Very good. Very nice. <laughs> and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to meat hook massacre. Yeah, I'm going to set X to 1. <laughs> oh my god. Awesome. Fucking awesome. Alright, it's your turn, Draco. Get out of my game. <laughs> Alright, uh, I don't know, let's keep this one. Ooh. But first, let's just... <laughs> and we still made two insects at the end of the turn, not Felix the Cat. Get out of my game! Excellent. Make some insects. Awesome. <laughs> Absolutely awesome. Play. Play. This deck is really, really fun. And really dumb. Alright, so let's, uh... Alright. Well, I'll go ahead and Haunted Ridge first. I'm planning on Power Word Killing. That was, all, that was really good. <laughs> yeah, play something, Tawi. Oh, I'm Tawi. I didn't mean to be so good. All right. Yeah, I think some interaction is all we needed. Move to the next level. Fuck. 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 Oh, shit. Fuck, man. Shit. Shit, fuck. Is there, is there anything we can do about that garbage? I hate the Righteous Valkyrie, man. Oh, I hate it so much. Oh, I can't stand that stupid Righteous Valkyrie, man. Infernal Grass seems better than Power Word Kill Main Deck. Maybe so, but we lose two life. Ugh. It's probably fine, because... Ugh. It's probably fine. Ugh. Fine. Probably. I hate it so much. What about Blood Chief's Thirst? Not instant speed. <sighs> no. Yes. God, I can't stand that shit. All right, let's let's hope our eye twitch dies. So we can exile a righteous Valkyrie. <laughs> Choose attackers. No, I don't want to. Old rut stain. Stain in my ruts. I'm a prosperous innkeeper. I just love prosperity so much. Fucking loser. Straight up, man, let me tell you. It is a good day to die. 
to exile with you. Bonk! I cannot wait to exile this idiot clown face. Give me my cards. I can't believe these guys were running cards. Kill this. Pop that. Ah. Alright. Let's get back in the action with old Rut Stain. Yes! Insects galore! Not Felix the Cat, are you paying attention? In fact, Nocho says, I thought it was alone in hating Righteous Valkyrie this much. Yeah, I hate that card. I hate that stupid idiot card. It's so stupid. I hate it. I, I hate that card. Do you under- Are you listening to me? I can't... Mm, I hate that card so much, because it's big. Oh, insects getting made. Bam. Oh, shit, yeah. Boom. Well, in that... Well... This is the combo. I mean, this is, yes, this is how we do it. This is the game. You may cast a creature from the top of your deck at any time. Why don't you cast another Righteous Valkyrie, loser? I'm getting in it. I'm like getting real, I'm getting passion. I'm getting some passion right now. Insects, throw your bodies. Mill. Take action. Boop. Boop. One, two. Yeah, I'm gonna put Crackle of Power away. My opponent is like, what? <laughs> I'm just cycling a crackle of power. Like, amazingly, I'm just cycling a crackle of power. So now they need to, off the top of the deck, think a solution. No. Oh, yes. Please, heal away. Sure, get big, get big. I think I think we may be I think we maybe did it. I think we maybe did it. Alright, let's try to get some let's get some land in the bin, shall we? Pretty good. Oh well, that's really good. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. really that's terrific is what it is that's really good i'll play another one this is the last one this is the last game oh that's so good
Alright, this is the last one. Oh, we didn't change the list. Okay, that's fine. Alright, this, this is the game. Yeah, we have all of our colors. So send that one back. So this... This has to be green, so this needs to be black. This has to be green. Alright. You know, I see these colors, so I'm just gonna get past summoning, because it's like really annoying to deal with. Let's see here. Oh, hell yeah. Boom. Bang. Ooh, give me that blood, baby. Blood of clock. I think I need to hurry up in this matchup. Yeah, I mean, the, I mean, the fact of the matter is that, like, I genuinely think that the crackle of power is, like, not even needed. Like, this, this is, like, the most useless thing here. So I'm going to pest summoning first. Because this list tends to struggle with, like, single target babies. Here I come. What? Come on, what are you doing? What are you doing? Sure, 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 sure. Environmental sciences. All right. Boom! One one o'clock, baby. All right, swing go time. Here we go. Look out! Day nine's coming to town. Bam! Bop! Bop! Pow! Boom! Bang! Ba boo! All right. Wow, we have gotten a losing win rate with this one, but this is a, this is a fun one. Okay, bye-bye. Um, yeah, I run two of these, man. I'm, like, fucking smart and shit. Someone is just trying their heart out. Like, as hard as someone can try to Jawari Disruption and Environmental Sciences is just incredible. I mean, this is something good here, huh? Some good stuff. Divide by zero, main phased. Unbelievable. Really, I mean, that's just, that's just a fascinating one to see. All right, let's see what villain does. Let's see what villain wants to do. Oh yeah, this is so fun. <sighs> Oh, Jesus Christ. This is fun. Heal, 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 heal. Fuck.
Oh, Rutstain. Welcome back. Boom. Give me that mana, baby. I take more turns! Oh, yeah. You know what's awesome? Is there's that black slime card that at the end of each end step it puts minus one minus one counters on all yo shit it's so good my favorite thing in the whole world is turns i want to grow up and be a turn oh my god what sweet justice is this oh my god x equals one two three four oh my god i mean it just it's incredible I mean, it's just astounding. Like, everything is right. Everything is correct in the world. This is this is wonderful. That's so good. Then my opponent's going to be like, My land attacks! Alright. It's going to be with them smack lands. Alright. Okay, well that card's pretty good. That's a pretty fair high quality card. I'm going to go on my turn, because this makes a creature. Cool. <laughs> uh, let's... Let me, let me see here. Do this. Probably the Death Camp Glade, the Dark War Pathway, the Environmental Sciences, the thing that lets me draw cards. Um, I probably only need one of the rut stains. Probably the pest summoning. Probably the pest summoning. Looks pretty good. Nice. Maniform hell guy. Hellman, Hellman, mana, mana friend, mana friend, Hellface, coming to town. Great, why don't you do this? Long for one. I mean, may as well. We might just win. I literally don't have enough mana. I can't believe I've done this. All right, let's do this. All right, send a few attacks, he dies. Oh, whoops, I need to deal two damage to that guy. I just don't even fucking know how the game works. And it doesn't matter because we made something beautiful. Okay, I need to go. Because I'm going to go on a date. Ah! So, okay, bye-bye. See you tomorrow for Try Hard Day. Do-do-do-do. Hip-hip, hooray.